Skin allergies are a common ailment in dogs. Uh, usually a go-to for most pet owners is a food allergy. They think that their dog must be allergic to something and that's why they're having a reaction on their skin. This isn't always the case. In fact, food allergies are a very uh, low possibility of why your dog might be having an allergic reaction. So. Uh, best thing you can do is take your dog to the vet, have them checked out, make sure that it's not some other underlying health condition. And if it does happen to be uh, a food allergy, then you can look into different recipes and your vet will probably recommend, uh, they should at least recommend different commercial dog food diets and you might be able to have a chat with them about homemade dog food uh, recipes for skin allergies. I'm going to share one of those with you today. If you are considering switching your dog to this recipe, just have a quick chat with your vet to make sure that it's going to be nutritionally balanced for your dog before feeding. To get this homemade dog food recipe for skin allergies started, I'm going to steam some vegetables. I have two medium carrots that are chopped into smaller pieces. I have a cup of broccoli florets, one cup of cauliflower florets, and half a cup of sliced zucchini. And you wanna cut these all into pieces that are an appropriate size for your dog. So I'm gonna let those steam for about 10 minutes. And while they're steaming, I am going to brown some ground turkey. It is two pounds of ground turkey. And I also have two tablespoons of turkey liver that I have pureed. So I'm going to uh, brown that with the ground turkey. And while the vegetables are steaming, this should brown nicely and I will show you how to finish the recipe. I finished my prep work and now it's time to put this homemade dog food recipe for skin allergies together. So I have drained my ground turkey and uh, pureed turkey liver. And the reason that you wanna drain that is because too much grease can be really hard on a dog's stomach um, and can lead to some digestive upset. So I've drained that and uh, my vegetables are steamed. So I'm gonna add those. And then I'm just gonna add two tablespoons of olive oil and kind of toss this all around together. And that's it, uh, your recipe is complete. I recommend feeding about a half a cup for every 20 pounds of body weight that your dog weighs. Uh, and th that's per serving, you wanna feed two servings a day. So let's say your dog weighs 20 pounds, you're gonna feed half a cup in the morning and half a cup in the evening. I hope that your dogs enjoyed this recipe as much as mine do.